How's everybody doing today? It is June 2nd of 2021 and I wasn't quite sure how to put this video together so I'm just going to do a rundown of the tomatoes that we have grown in our yard um, really quick. Um, pretty much every variety is out here and I will let you know which ones we are growing. We also gave away hundreds of plants, probably another 10 to 15 varieties out to friends and family in our local community so we'll probably see uh, more varieties than are in the yard here show up this season but uh, I just wanted to for our personal log to kind of uh, run down everything that we have here these first three right here hold on a second <coughs> these first three in the center of our yard there's two black crim two Cherokee purple and two Hawaiian pineapple those are the three mains we wanted in our yard they're looking a little bit raggedy um, they're probably the ones that we had in the cups a little too long before transplanting but they are transplanted and they are the center of our yard is the Hawaiian pineapple, Cherokee purple and black crim, two plants of each. And then I'll start up here at the end. This is one Paul Robeson. This is two black cherry and then in the center is an atomic grape. This is two blue cream cherry. This is a blue beauty and a black beauty. This one right here is a two Ava purple ball. This one is two black trifil. This one right here is two amana orange. And those are primarily the main varieties that we have in our yard, mostly indeterminate uh, heirloom types, um, all non-red. So there's nine, 10, 11, 12 varieties there. And then I'll show you guys the dwarf tomatoes. That's a dwarf purple heart. These all come from the dwarf tomato project and we have seven varieties. A dwarf purple heart, one. We have two uh, Tasmanian chocolate, one Mr. Snow, one lemon ice, and one pineapple stripes. And back here, we have backups of the three new varieties, the Tasmanian chocolate, the emerald evergreen, and the Egyptian yellow. Those are three um, backups of the new varieties that we got. Over here is the Emerald Evergreen Dwarf and the Egyptian Yellow Dwarf uh, tomato plants. This right here is two plants of the Black from Tula tomato. And the sprouts were just doing too good and we kind of had like a backup backup. And so when we still had a hold of these looking nice, we just decided to use our extra soil and put them in this bin. And this is two berries Crazy Cherry and same thing as uh, the black from Tula is these are uh, two last minute varieties that made it into our yard from uh, unique ones that we had for backups and then this right here is two more that we plan on just giving away hopefully to neighbors or friends or family that have a vehicle to come pick them up but this is an extra dwarf Mr. Snow and an extra emerald giant Mr. Snow emerald giant so seven types of dwarfs um, in total, we were counting them up and we have 37 tomato plants in our yard and 21 different varieties. So this is UT and Angel. It is June 2nd, 2021 and the mana bar is full. We love you guys. Uh, we'll catch you next time. Thanks for watching. All right, a quick little follow up for the tomato video I wanted to show. Um, this is our downstairs little bathroom where we also grow plants, um, the avocado, the lemon trees. And I wanted to show you two more varieties of tomato and um, four more plants. So these two right here are mini bell and we haven't got those to flowering or producing anything yet. We've had them for quite a while. They're more just house plants than anything else like that. I think they will eventually, especially if we take them outside. But we're not counting these in the varieties that we're growing out in the yard. Um, the ones out in the yard, we have 37 plants of 21 different varieties. So technically, if you were to claim these four plants, this is a Tiny Tim, this is a Tiny Tim, and this is a mini bell, mini bell, both micro tomato types. Um, they're getting really leggy on us. But if you were to count these, we would have 23 different types and 41 plants. But we're not going to count these. These are micro tomatoes just for fun. Um, this tiny Tim was actually, we're not going to count this either, but it was the first tomatoes of the year. We had two red tomatoes and on Mother's Day, um, we took those to Angel to eat. But 
Micro tomatoes, really cool. Um, if you do a really good job with them, uh, they probably needed more light so they didn't get so leggy. They've had to be um, top down a little bit. This one's flowering. This is the one where the two reds came from. And we got another one in uh, pots down here. But I wanted to show you a couple more varieties of tomato that are, are part of our indoor grow and not a part of our outdoor um, stuff, but the Tiny Tim and the Mini Bell. The two red ones that were on there, we're not counting those as our first tomatoes of the year. That was just to kind of uh, test out testing. And uh, Angel had both of those. They were really good. Not as good as uh, being grown outdoors, but um, still a pretty good little micro tomato to grow inside your house and uh, have fresh tomatoes rather than um, going to the store. We haven't bought tomatoes from the store in years now. So um, just everything from our yard and everything from everything that we share. So. We love you guys. Um, we appreciate the time you're spending with us. And we'll catch you next time. Thanks for watching.